The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. Uh, I think Happy Corbin is the luckiest man in WWE. Why? I would agree with that assessment. Let's talk about this, Cole. From riches to rags, back to riches. How can you not be inspired by Happy Corbin? He doesn't have to rub it in our face. Hey, why can't this guy be humble? I don't get it. Why be humble, Cole? Happy Corbin has never been richer or happier. Listen, Saxton has no money, and he doesn't say anything about it. Corey, you've got all the money in the world, and you don't brag about it. So why does Corbin have to do it? It's a matter of personal choice. Nicer clothes, faster cars. Corbin has always lived large, just now larger than ever. You think Corbin will give me a ride in one of his fast cars? Are you guys ready? I am. For Shinsuke Nakamura! The thing about Nakamura is that he's such a cunning veteran. He's been a champion around the world. Those title reigns include NXT and WWE, a list of accolades a mile long. Are you guys ready for Shinsuke in action? Oh, yeah. But don't get lulled into the charisma. You are looking at one of the most dangerous combat artists in sports entertainment. There is no one like him. Introducing the challenger from Kansas City, weighing in at 275 pounds, Happy Corbin! And introducing the champion from Kyoto, Japan, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, The Intercontinental Championship, one of the most prestigious titles in all of sports entertainment. The WWE Intercontinental title on the line. Perhaps a new chapter will be written in this championship's long history. For over 40 years, the WWE's best. Maybe that will set him up. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Making that shoulder a priority. Submission time. It's the Dragon Sleeper. Give up now. Swallow your pride and submit. He is not willing to go to sleep yet. Catches a punch. Legs caught. Clothesline takes him down. Forget about it. Really just laying it in. 
What does Happy Corbin need to do to live up to his name and have a happy night? He just keeps smiling, obviously. As far as the match goes, he needs to lean onto his power game and just keep throwing those heavy hands and slams. That'll put him in an even better mood. Ah, what a smash! That is just insulting. Shinsuke Nakamura with a nice reversal. He turns it around on Corbin. Vicious knee to the body. Full axe kick. The challenger eating up some damage. Driven down face first. Reversal. What a counter. Right hook. Getting him into the corner. Driving the face down. No, no! My God. Oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. Oh, right on the arm. Ooh, man, what a hit. Choke slam backbreaker. Here's a pin for the title. Nakamura somehow escaped before the pinfall. He can't let that discourage him. He's got to keep on the offensive. The king of strong style is being dismantled. Happy Corbin utilizing his power game. Looking like he's having an even better night than usual. The champ is down. Title change. I can feel it. The champ kicks out with authority. Still in it. What a gutsy performance. Oh, what are they doing here? All the way out. Sit out, Gord Buster. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. First from the Gord Buster to retain the title. Kick out. Getting that shoulder up now is huge. King Shasa. The champ will stay champ. Two. It's all over. It's Shinsuke Nakamura gets the decisive victory to retain the championship. Here is your winner, and still, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, King Nakamura! A big win, and the celebration has begun. Come on, guys, sing along.